Welcome to this Sports Report update. I'm Matt Finkel. Beautiful day for golf at Fox's Den in Salina. 20 schools competing in the Salina Invitational. Started off on the par 4 ninth. Anna Zach Watrin tripping from just off the green to within a foot. Rockets shoot 342 as a team, finishing ninth place. Liberty Benton, Caden Robinson takes care of business with that putt. Eagles shoot a combined 336, sixth place overall. How about Salina's David Jenkins? Sewing some nice wedge work. Chipping on, running it just past the hole. Hosts shoot a combined 349 on the day. Good for 12th. On to the par 5, 18th. Carter Bowman of St. Mary's chipping over some water. Runs it to within a couple of feet from the hole. Would knock that in for par. Bowman shoots a 73. That's the second lowest round of the day. One stroke behind Drew Wayman, 72 from Wapa. Rough Riders shoot 333 as a team and place fourth. Kenton's Britton Hensel with a downhill putt for par, right to left on the break, not a problem. Wildcats shoot 332 and come in third place. Ricky Bowman of Defiance putting for bogey there, knocks it in. Bulldogs 10th, 344. How about Elida's Larson Hurst? That putt is true. Bulldogs shoot 380 and finish in 14th. Still on the 18th, Marion Locals Colin Fleck putting for bogey, knocks it down 382 for the Flyers and 15th place. Minster's Austin Brackman hitting his third from the fairway. This one is right up there, spins it back towards the hole. Wildcats shoot 334 as a team and earn fifth place. Same hole, Shawnee's Ian Hastings also hitting his third, perfectly done, sticks it to about five feet, would nail the birdie putt. 341 for the Indians, good for eighth place. It was a battle of Wildcats for the team title. Back to the ninth, Bass, Brady Garver using a wedge from the fairway. Perfect placement would drain the putt. Wildcats shoot 322, including a 74 for Spencer Stubbs. Was it enough? Kaleida's Colin Nartker hits this putt, and his team also shoots a 322, but they beat out Bath on a tie break and claim the Salina Invitational. Lots of good golf out there today, and more to come throughout the fall. That's going to do it for this Sports Report update. We'll see you next time on WOSN.